is the thing that I never hear mentioned, but is fundamental to understanding the cult thinking that envelops Trump's world. Jim Jones drank the Kool-Aid in Guyana too. Jones believed his own apocalyptic bullshit, just as Trump nodded in agreement and looked around for approval as I spoke that day in church. The reason cults exist is because the cult leader has manifested his own crazy way of seeing the world. Judd Kushner personifies this illness as the grandson of a Holocaust survivor who was forced to hide in the woods in the family's village in Poland from the Nazis during the Second World War, he now stood silently to the side while Trump demeaned and dehumanized immigrants. Remember when I said in the foreword that you're not going to like me or the things I did? Well, this is an example. I praised Trump in ways that I knew were not only untrue but downright dishonest, stooping so low as to invoke the plight of my own ancestors in Eastern Europe during the Second World War. Hard to think of a way I could have topped that particular load of horseshit, except to say that I actually believed myself at the time, at least on some level, as I willfully turned a blind eye to all the red alert signals I had witnessed 